So it's two days later, just shooting this right now. I think I'm gonna do this one day tomorrow. Very quiet in here. Everybody's favorite fella has passed on. It was, uh, it seemed to be like a, the quickest, most peaceful passing you could ever imagine. I did, it caught me off guard even. He, uh, like that morning he threw up and peed on the garage floor. And I thought, well, he must have like just eaten something that he shouldn't have. Uh, cleaned it up, put him out on the deck. It's happened before. Like we live out in the county. Sometimes he eats some raccoon poop or something. So I didn't think much of it. He actually seemed to be getting better throughout the day. He was moving around, drinking water. And then uh, it was about four o'clock. It looked like he went down to take a nap and passed away. What the heck? It was pretty unexpected. His favorite treat was strawberries. So one more strawberry for Chip and make it official. So this is still gonna be a completely legit one day. Little strawberry crankbait. For some reason this strawberry has a face. I just, I'm trying to match that. And that's what I drew out. So let's get this built. It's the day. Today's today. Uh, eight, 38. So I'm kind of hoping that since this is a pretty standard crankbait, we can make it official pretty easy. I better not snag this. I got a lot of detail up here in the head to carve and all of it kind of fits within those two parameters, the top and bottom of those strawberry foliage designs right there. I'm keeping a flat spot right there. Strawberry with a face. Got the lip going. Everything's looking fantastic so far. I plugged in the lead pot, that's about hot. 10 millimeter hole. I'm gonna pour the lead with that screw eye in the lead hole. That way it leaves a little pilot hole for it without having to drill anything. I'm gonna do something after sealing the wood to achieve the seeds. Achieve the seeds. And that something involves UV resin. Lead's hot. 14 drops, make that 15. Okay, on to the point of the video, which is probably Chip right now. Chippy, Chip, Chip, Chip. What are you, did you eat something? Come here, good boy, fuck up, good boy. Chippy, sit. Good boy, that's a good boy.
Okay, this is gonna get a super glue brushing. Nice, thin, light coat applied consistently. I even taped off the lip. If you apply it with a brush, you can keep it very thin everywhere so it doesn't bubble up. Just instantly flash dries. That's a well-sealed bait right there. Marking with a pencil where I think I want the seeds to go before I commit. That was some UV resin over the eye. Gonna make that eye look a whole lot better. Gave both of them some dimension. Video's not over till Chip's in it. Come here, come on. Oh. <laughs> You're not being a good boy, but... Okay, we're gonna start with white. Then we're gonna do a even coat of Wicked Red. After we get the color on, I should be able to see the seed placement. And then we're gonna individually brush on each yellow little seed. And of course I made one side have way more seeds than the other. Like I really packed them in on that side for some reason. I like that side better. That's the thumbnail side. Sometimes strawberry seeds are completely red. Sometimes they're a little green. And sometimes they're like an off yellow like this. I'm just going with the off yellow for the contrast. I'm gonna put black on the top and white on the bottom. And it's gonna be like an actual crankbait with a face with that traditional dark to light transition, if you know what I'm talking about. Stay out of the strawberries, Chip. Yep, Chip. Chip. Bad dog. Bad dog. Chip, I gave you a strawberry last bit. No, no. Come here. Come. You got a strawberry in the last video, Chip. Chip! Bad dog! Get out of strawberries. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh boy. All right, now I'm just basing all the details with white and uh, I'm gonna leave the eyeball white. This kind of detail can be precarious because you wanna leave things separate. Like I don't wanna come all the way up to that white line on the eyebrow there whilst applying this white. I'm so close to screwing up and I didn't. Whew. Yeah, if there's no white base coat under it, that green's really forgiving. You can't really see it on the red. That is a glorious little strawberry. I put the black on top. I'm not gonna do anything to the belly. It just kinda, the seeds fade out and it lightens up a little bit. That's perfect. I like that. Clear coat. Chip would just snatch this thing out of my hands. Okay, Chip, today's your lucky day. Sit. Good boy. Now you have to stay out of the strawberries. Because I gave you one. Good boy. Gonna let the excess drip off of this one. That way you can kind of see the details and the texture and the strawberry seeds. That ended up being a completely flawless clear coat. I like the drip dry technique instead of the rotisserie. I feel like the rotisserie like mounds it up and when it's thick in some spots and thin in others, it, it bubbles. But when it's consistent, it's perfect. What are you gonna do? I jumped for the camera. Come here. 
Maybe we could just do a video that's like an hour long of just chip. You guys want that? Let's just do that. I would bet it all that this bait works, but let's see how good. About as good as it possibly could. Doesn't even float up too fast. Gonna be able to get it down there a little ways, which is good for this time of the year. Feels like maybe five feet. Action city. Oh my goodness, that's good. Let's go make it official. This one's for Chip. Say it. On to the next bait. Say it. It's 146. I took my time making that. I mean, it took a long time too. Every one of those seeds, you know, I had to go over a few times. But the end result is immaculate. That's a gorgeous bait. Last cast here, then we're gonna go somewhere better. We'll see. We're gonna go somewhere else though. On to the next bait. On to the next bait. Wouldn't it be so cute if you could say that? That's right. Another pond. You're not gonna catch me at the river with this. This pond's a bit snaggy though, so careful, careful. Let's see if they're awake. Can I get a crappie? Oh, 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 it was just about official. I made some inappropriate noises. I'm gonna go get my pliers. Wow, it was just about official. That came out of structure, a little tappy tap off the bank. I got my heart pumping. Okay, I'm back. That is a fish, oh my goodness. Fish on. Fish on. It's official. I couldn't tell that was a fish at first. Bottom lipped him. It's official. Pond bass like strawberries too, just like Chippy. We did it. Be free. Be free. Success. I'll still take a crappie. Oh, that was another. I feel like there are crappie down there just lipping this thing. Just old soft lips. That's what nobody calls crappie, old soft lips. Got him. That's not a crappie. Oh, it's official again. Yep, just go ahead and finish doing that. Smaller pond bass like strawberries as well. Be free. They're coming up and hitting something that's like less than two feet under the surface. This is good. Oh, I just had another hit. The bank again. Woo. 
Strawberries are pretty official. Pretty official. Be free. Oh. Whew. That one splashed us. In the weeds. This one's covered in gunk right now. And we caught a fish anyway. Woo! They just get smaller and smaller. But this is fantastic. Whoa. Oh. Right. Three o'clock. One day complete. That was top water. Okay, this fish went into some structure. He might come back out. That's not good. I'm just gonna wait. Oh, I got it. I thought I lost it. I just lost the fish. Wow, that was a miracle. Seriously, that felt like a pop off if I've ever felt one. Just boop, we got it back. Whew, how nerve wracking. <laughs> just cast in the exact same spot. I kind of wish I caught that fish. It seemed big because it went down so hard, you know? I should have just cranked that thing in. There we go. Super official, still have it. We're gonna miss them. Very happy to have had them. Tough stuff. You guys are probably pretty sad too. He's seriously been a part of the channel ever since I started it. Since before I even talked in videos, he was there. He had his youthful puppy vigor right at the beginning. I suppose that was the official farewell to Chippy. Felt right. Good stuff. <clears throat> it's a tough on to the next bait, man. On to the next bait.